Uh, we're here. Jonathan Haggerty won Fight Night 19. He's a two-sport world champion. He's here to defend his Muay Thai title against Felipe Lobo. How are you feeling about your camp and, you know, just since your last fight against Fabricio? Yeah, we're feeling on top of the world. Uh, camp's been going really well, thank you. Um, done a good nine-week fight camp out in Costa Samui at La Maya Muay Thai. Mm -hmm. um, it's been hard, but we've got through it. All training camps are hard, you know, we've left no stone on terms. And uh, come the weekend we'll show that and um, we're coming to do a demolition job. Mm -hmm. Were you able to take some time off, get some rest after your last one? Uh, I had uh, Christmas and New Year's off and then uh, I've still had my foot on the pedal. You know, I've got both belts now and I know there's a big target on my back. So uh, mm -hmm. we've got to stay straight, we've got to stay professional and yeah, that's it. Yeah. You know, and you've proven that you can do kickboxing and you can do Muay Thai, you're basically unstoppable right now. Which rule set do you prefer? I definitely prefer the, the Muay Thai rule set. Yeah. For sure. But I, it was exciting. Um, there's a new, uh, new chapter, kickboxing, and um, I'm, I'm looking forward to defending it. Yeah. Okay. And Felipe Lobos, ranked number three. How do you see the fight playing out? Uh, I only see it one way, and that's uh, me by winning. I knock out. Um, he's a great opponent. He's very wor he's a worthy opponent, and uh, there's a lot of things I should be looking out for. Mm -hmm. But um, as long as I'm 100, percent which I always am, um, we shouldn't have any problems. Yeah, well, you've had a few knockout predictions, and you weren't wrong. So, uh, you know, what do you see as Lobo's biggest strength that you have to prepare for? His biggest strength. He's got great, um, great speed. Mm -hmm. um, he's been in the game a long time, he's been in there with some great uh, great fighters, so he's, he's experienced, but um, yeah, it's, it's like he can't compare to me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you are the title holder, so Thank he's you. got more to come up against. And if you win, you know, still basically on a huge win streak here, what do you want to do next? Do you want to move weight classes? You know, we've talked about MMA a bit, but where do you see it going? Uh, we're not looking past Lobo, we're, we're, we're focused on this weekend, we've got a task, a big task ahead of us. But um, Fabrizio Andrade's MMA belt, I've got it on my mind, I've had it on my mind since the day I beat him. So um, that could be a possibility. Long term goal. Mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe short term. Okay, we'll keep an eye out for it. And you know, your little brother had his debut last month, how was that, being in his corner and seeing him out there? It was very nerve wracking. <laughs> um, I couldn't speak. I literally couldn't speak because I wasn't in control. You know, it was my little brother, mm -hmm. and um, it was great to see him uh, achieve his dreams. You know, he's always been watching me growing up um, on the, the big stage, and now it's his turn. Yeah. And I truly do believe is he will be the one championship world champion. Okay, two brothers out there like mm. the Rotolo brothers, maybe. That'd be great. Yeah. Okay. Well, any final words to your fans and your haters out there? Um, just want to say a massive thank you for following and supporting. Uh, you guys are great. And uh, make sure you tune in this weekend because I'll be putting on a demolition job. And uh, it was going to be exciting. It's going to be fireworks. So uh, tune in. Okay, well, you heard it. Tune in this weekend for Jonathan Haggerty defending his Muay Thai title at One Fight Night 19. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much.